when we had uh, the confrontation, it was Triple H, he come out first. He spit some water, guys. It's amazing. We were discussing when that was happening. How did he even come up with this? Like, he just literally sat backstage one day and I thought, Joe, my spit entrance water. is going to spit water. I'm going to do it. But it's actually really clever because if someone spits water, you automatically know who they're talking yeah. about. It's like, it's like, do you remember that time you sent me that? It was like a video of like every like people pretending to be wrestlers yeah and he just ran was in the office and he was just drunk water and then just said <laughs> yeah and it was just like triple h yeah. <laughs> um so triple h come out he was like yeah i want sting to come out yeah. so sting come out pretty much straight away which is good i hate all that waiting around for no yeah, reason yeah just like come out if you dare yeah, yeah. <laughs> and um triple h said some good things you know you might be in the hall of fame you know, my you can't, right? Yeah. <laughs> and like, you know, just general triple H. I <laughs> like I can't even pinpoint what we were saying, but no. it was like I just literally turned to call with Triple H's back, people. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell he's enjoying himself. He's like, I'm here, I have arrived, I am back. I thought you were gonna say, you. I'm here, I quit. Oh. I really thought you were about to say that for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it was good. Like yeah. I love it when Triple H is like this. I hate it when he's like, I'm I'm bored. <laughs> yeah, he always wants like, the tea. Yeah. The show it, it was weird he didn't wear his suit as well. Yeah, he like you knew that it was down to business when he wore his suit. Yeah, because every, every night on Raw he's in a suit. Yeah, and then he comes on a pay per view in leather. Yeah, and jeans. jeans and like taped hands. You know that's, that means business. So then uh, all of a sudden, Triple H texting, and he goes onto the ring and pulls out a sledgehammer. Yeah! And then uh, as he goes to a texting with the sledgehammer, all of a sudden, Sting's got a baseball bat, a black one. Black one. Yeah, that's what he has, isn't it? Don't really, I shouldn't get black ones. They're quite no, nice. I think it's just a Sting one, isn't it? Because, um, yeah. Sting one's doing it in the shop, and oh shit, everyone's killing them. <laughs> yeah. Um, and he literally just, like, held the bat under Triple H's chin, pushed him into the uh, turnbuckle. And then was like, what's it so yeah, after Triple H dropped his sledgehammer, it yeah, bounced a lot. Which bounced a lot. Yeah. I couldn't figure out if it was <laughs> rubber, the, yeah, or the floor, because the floor is quite bouncy and yeah. it's wrestling floor. And Sting didn't say anything, but as Cole just said, he pointed the bat at WrestleMania sign, which is very well placed. Good fight opportunities. Yes. But then he did it again. I think that ruined it. He should have only just done it once. So then he kind of kept poking Triple H under the chin, and <laughs> he kind of walked off. And Triple H just, no, and then he did his special move on Triple H. I don't know what it's called, but it's really crap. Yeah. <laughs> he just calls him and drops him. Yeah. And then the Sting walked out, and that was that, really. And Triple H just like, was lying on the middle of the floor looking quite happy with himself. Yeah, so I, I've had my moment. <laughs> this is going to be on YouTube. <laughs> I'm back, Betches. Yeah. <laughs> like, fabulous time. <laughs> <laughs> fabulous. The Divas match is Paige versus Nikki. Nikki shouldn't wear a yellow. <laughs> Sorry, for the Divas Championship. Now, we both said Nikki was going to win this, but we had to flip a coin. I got Nikki. <laughs> and Nikki won. <laughs> 3 1, bitches. 3 1. I was still right, though, to be fair. Yeah, you were. But the coin hates you. Yeah. <laughs> Usually hates you. What I know. Done to it? God. Did I flip it? Yeah. We should, no, we both took it in turns. No, I didn't flip it today. Did you not? No, last time we took it in turns. Oh. Yeah, the coin is not against you anymore. I know. About mm. time. <laughs> um, so the match was it was quite quick, weren't it? It wasn't really yeah. much. And uh, Paige had like a clothing malfunction. Her yeah. Top broke. <laughs> and she had a ripping her tie. It just all just went wrong for her. Yeah. Um, and she should have worn the fairy outfit again. She should have. That's an omen, that is. That was a nice and, outfit. Um, Nikki won by cheating. She like grabbed her tights. Apparently so. Um, so then we had Dean Ambrose versus Badness Barrett for the Intercontinental Championship. Now I said Badness Barrett was going to win. I said Dean. Because I like Dean. Technically, uh, no, I won. Dean got disqualified. <laughs> but technically, I was also right because Badness Barrett ended up on the floor. Yeah, but you got disqualified. Technicality. Technicality. Five, five, one. <laughs> Not like that. It's all how the ah. tables have turned. Oh, I'm so smug because everyone was agreeing with Coral's predictions, and now I'm like, ha, yeah, ha. Nick was right. bitch. I know my shit, people. <laughs> um, it's me. I'm right in WWE. Um, mm. she's cheating. <laughs> she? I know, so rude. How she? Um, the match wasn't very good. <laughs> I didn't think it was that good. It, no, it, it did harm my attention. And I was too busy uploading enough photos. <laughs> Of us two. <laughs> you see what I mean? Like it wasn't like it was good, 
but, but not, not potentially good enough. enough. Yeah, and I don't understand why they disqualified Dean for that. No. But it was like when Rusev used to kick Jack Swagger. Yeah, it was like, yeah, you're also disqualified now. It's like, what? Okay, yeah. that's a new rule. I didn't know mm. it existed. But yeah, that was it, really. There wasn't really much to say, was nice. there? It was very quick. Yeah. It was over and done with pretty much about ten minutes. Yeah. So I got stitched. Oh, no. But yeah, well, it weren't... Like, they were still good. They're not bad. No. <laughs> um, it could have been better, though. Yeah, it could have been better, though. But I think... The way they built it up on SmackDown, they made it sound amazing. Yeah. Oops, just the whole it, it was good. But I think by this point, I was getting tired as well when I watched it last time. So. But maybe I wasn't as tired as I thought and just maybe weren't as into it. Yeah, I just don't think you were into it. <laughs> but it's not as bad as like most pay per views when you have a match you're not into. You're just like, oh. Yeah, I was going to play ball. Yeah, yeah. This, this was just like, it was there. Yeah. I'm cool with that. I just hit you. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> she hits me all the time. <laughs> uh, yeah, and. Uh, which was good. Dean stole Bernie's Barrett's title. Which is what we've been asking for. Someone just to steal something. Yeah. <laughs> he just walked off. I love that the commentators were like, somebody get security. <laughs> and no one. He just walked out. No. He just walked out. Jan Jan, I think of the past now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so then uh, after that match, there was an amazing segment, guys. So. Oh, yeah. You see these people come out in robes. It's gone a bit dark. And you hear the oh, 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 oh. and you've got like the lanterns and the fire at the end and people standing around. Yeah. I bet it's nice and warm. I'm really cold right now. I really want to go down there. <laughs> you're the one to be Dean. And the casket cut. There's a dong. You're waiting for the dong. Yeah. And you're waiting. You're like dong. <laughs> that was like your Hoover impression <laughs> of the crowd. <laughs> you remember that? No. You kind of go. <laughs> that was the day you were doing Cesaro impressions. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> I just had a flashback to that. That's funny. Um, yeah, the dong happened. Dong. And then um, basically the casket com- was dragged out. And we were like, oh my god, oh my god it's Undertaker. Undertaker is here. Oh my god, there was rumors of him coming. In anyway, yeah, like, oh my I didn't god. believe them, so I was very no. shocked. I was like, Oh my god, his music! <laughs> <laughs> I actually freaked out and was already on Twitter. I was like, Ow! I got a text at like two in the morning, like, Oh my god, <laughs> Undertaker! <laughs> and then, yeah, another text come through a few seconds later, It's Bray Wyatt! <laughs> Plot twist! <laughs> so basically, the casket opens and Bray sits up. I was like, this is amazing. But not only that, I was like, we were so on it. Because in our uh, Smackdown review, we were like, he's so talking about the Undertaker. Yeah. So talking about him. We knew. So this is like confirmed everything and told us that we are in fact getting the Undertaker versus Bray Wyatt at WrestleMania. WrestleMania. Boom! Burn. So excited! Yeah, better be good. Um, yeah. But brace up, and the crowd automatically went insane. Yeah, and it's good because it could have gone one of each yeah. ways. And but I think the thing is, the crowd's very like, ah, yeah, it's gonna be good. They weren't booing. They're like, oh my god, that's clever. Yeah. Like, because oh, automatically went, that's genius. Like, plot to WWE have done the right thing for a change. Yeah, they like, have. I did not see that coming no. at all. It was perfect. Even though it's kind of obvious after it happens, you're like, oh, oh yeah, but, but yeah. You're just so you're so into the whole. Oh my god, Undertaker's music! It's brave. What? Oh my god! That's so clever. And <laughs> Braden's so proud of himself. Yeah. He's like, yeah. This I is his this. moment. I think this is his like everything. You know what I mean? Yeah. This is, it's a highlight, career highlight for him. Yeah, I mean, yeah. It's gotta be. I mean, come on, he's he's going against Undertaker. Like who has like not like twenty one people have done that. Probably more than that. But you mean but, WrestleMania? Yeah, WrestleMania. Yeah. yeah. 21. So you've got. I'm trying to think who there was there. Well, Shawn there's Michaels. There's 21 of them. <laughs> there's Shawn Michaels. Rick Flair. Rick Flair. Brock Lesnar, obviously. Brock Lesnar, Punk. Triple H, I think, as well, at one point. Yeah. I can't think of um, anyone. Did John Cena? Edge. Sure, it was Edge. Sure, I've seen that much. It might not be been uh, on the I think there was. Kane, obviously, done that couple, tried to beat him a couple of times. Yeah. I don't think Daniel Bryan ever got shot, though. No. He could be next year. <laughs> no, Bray's going to end it. But yeah. What we were saying, and our, our friend Matt made a very good point, um, Undertaker's already a defeated man now. Yeah, it's pointless. It's, it is essentially pointless, and I wish they could have just waited and said, it's, it's Bray. It, it's Bray's, a, it's Bray's the one to, to continue it. And obviously, he, 
it could it could have been twenty one and one if Bray went that's it I win. I'm, I'm, face I'm of now zero zero or one and none. I take over your streak now. Yeah. Better than good. But, um... Yeah, you can't... Like, essentially, he's not as strong as he was now because no. he's already been beaten. But Bray was saying how he used to fear the Undertaker... Well, not the Undertaker. He used to fear you. He says you, he said the name. Yeah. And now you're just like everybody else. And A he's... Week. Yeah, and I'm going to be the new face of fear. And he got a few cheers for that. Yeah. And there, there was lights in the background. You know how he has his lights for yeah. people. So it's quite good. I think that's going to be a very 50-50 match. You know? Yeah. I'm quite I mean, I want Bray to win. But at the same time, it's like, I to take a quick can't lose twice. again. twice. No, but at the same time, Bray needs to win this. He it's, can't not win. It's the legacy. Yeah. It's going to start Bray's legacy and Undertaker was to be done. Because he's mm. old now. He needs to stop. But they really should not have fucked it up with Brock last year. Yeah. If I could go back to... If I had a time machine, that's one thing I'd do. Yeah. Go back and like, no, this no. is wrong. <laughs> wrong. Brace turn next year. Yeah, it'd be amazing. It's like shit. Imagine how much more you'd be into this match. Yeah, if it was 21, 22 and 0 still. Because it would have been like, oh my god, could he finally end the streak? Yeah. Because I mean, there was so much hype the year before Brock with Punk. Everyone generally believed that Punk was going to end the streak. Mm. Everyone generally believed that. And when he didn't, everyone was like, oh my god. So the fact that Brock did it the year after with not as much hype, yeah. everyone was just like, really? No, like, I remember the second it happened. If you watch that clip, it's just like everyone just kind of, everyone's heart dropped. Yeah. It's just that second where you're like, what just happened? Like, this, this can't be real. It's like, but that is, that is it. Everyone was just like, Brock? But we have a video of discussing this. We're not going to discuss it. We've already got a video on it. Go yeah, and look we do, it. don't we? Go and yeah. look at it. <laughs> we did that one. Yeah. yeah. Keep with the times, Carol. Yeah, keep with the times. <laughs> um, then we had a match <laughs> after Bray was done. That was pretty good. That's like the highlight of his pay It was a very me. good moment. Yeah. I mean, I don't really like pay per speaking segments in, but that no, was perfect. No, it's just perfect. It couldn't have been done on a Raw. No, it definitely down. couldn't have. It was too big. It was yeah. Like, if you're using Undertaker's music and he's not there... That has to be done yeah. on a paper. I'm interested to see what Raw's going to be like. Yeah. I don't think Undertaker's going to be there. No. I guess if it's wrong, but I really don't. But keep, this guy keeps telling us, if you're watching, can you stop? <laughs> <laughs> He's not going to be there. And that's when he turns up. I'm like, yeah, sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, uh, no, he might be there. This guy, I can't remember his name now. Is it Neil? It's Neil. Hello, know. Neil. Um, we think something's going to happen, like Bray being in a match and the lights will go. Yeah, I don't think I'm so good something related yet. to it. Will yeah, go, but I don't. I think I don't think he's going to show his face to WrestleMania. Yeah, agreed. And the thing is, it's funny because it's just like the whole Sting Brock thing. We're like, why aren't they there? Undertaker turns up once a year, and we, no one goes, why aren't he there? But it works that he's not there. Yeah, if he was there, it's like he rises from the dead once a year. Yeah, exactly. Just to, it works. It works. But I hope that doesn't. Like obviously, Undertaker had a big career before that, so I'm hoping. Bray has a big career. Yeah, me too. This is the beginning. He deserves one. The beginning. So then we had John Cena versus Rusev after that. And, um... Do you know what? It was okay. I mean, it wasn't amazing. Do you know what? Last night when I watched it, I was very, very into this match. I was very surprised. I can't... I'm the first person to bash John Cena. I hate John Cena. I absolutely... I still hate John Cena. Okay? <laughs> Not particularly big fans of Rusev either. No, I... Rusev, we've grown, Rusev we've been, he's been growing on us the last few days, uh, days, weeks, but I generally, generally, generally enjoyed this match last night. Rewatching it, it's still good, but not not the hype I had for it last night. See, I thought it was okay. I thought there was too many submission moves. Yeah. Um, and Lana interrupting it really annoyed me. Cause she, she got in the ring and she, she distracted the ref. Right. Which means Rusev low blowed John Cena, did his Patriot Log. Is it Patriot Log? No, that's not Patriot Log. Don't ask me for names, you know this. <laughs> no, it's not Patriot Log, because that's, that's, that's Jack Swagger. Yeah. <laughs> it's something. <laughs> <laughs> You're worried, Jack Swagger. He should have come out and <laughs> saved John Cena. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, he did his log. I can't remember what it's called, it's going to bug me now. I wouldn't know. Carl, don't ask me. it twice. <laughs> I don't. I was tweeting. <laughs> I wasn't this. I actually generally have my phone down. Very um, rare I have my phone down. He did his move. <laughs> he did the thing, and um, John Cena passed out. So Rusev won, and um, I said Rusev's gonna win this. Uh, what would you say, Carl? 
I am the third John Cena. So I won again. 6-1. Yeah. <laughs> so we haven't finished yet, but yeah. Cole's going to be doing her fan fiction on yeah. the <laughs> Fifty Shades of Bray. <laughs> he comes out of the casket and yeah. Bray's... No, Dean's waiting for him. <laughs> it's time to wax you up. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. Yeah, no, either. I don't know. You've got, you've got all day tomorrow to think about it. I know. <laughs> Actually, you got to Wednesday. I'm not free until Wednesday. Oh, do you Oh, no. Uh, yeah, I'm free. So you got two By days. By the time we get home from work, yeah, I'm free. Good day to think about it. Um, I think. Anyway, uh, the Rusev mm-hmm. match was done. And I'm glad there was no faffing around after the match. Like, no. oh, I'm going to beat up John Cena again. And all that rubbish. Yeah, I, I generally thought after John Cena kind of like, awoke um, mm. <laughs> yeah. uh, that he was going to go attack Rusev. And I'm so glad he didn't. No. I'm glad he just walked away. Um, I don't think this is going to be a very good feud, but I'm also. Oddly intrigued. It's, you know it's going to be. Oh, we all know John Cena's going to win at WrestleMania. I respect him. Uh, <laughs> he beat me fair as well. Yeah. You're now my when, when Rusev turns face, <laughs> I respect you. <laughs> you beat me that one time. <laughs> oh, dear. But can we get rid of Lana, please? She's really Yeah, she's starting to get really annoyed. We liked her at first. Yeah. But now we're starting to like Rusev. We don't like her either. No. So then we had the main event. It was Daniel Bryan versus Roman Reigns. Whoop. Whoop. And this was for obviously the WrestleMania spot, which Roman Reigns already has. Um, and the match, because we've already seen a lot on SmackDown and Raw, it wasn't special because no. we've seen it all. It just wasn't. It's the same old moves, you know, the knee, the face, the spear, <laughs> the punch, you know. I only just got that he does a spear because he's an ex football player, and that's what they do. I didn't get that until you t- text yeah. me about that, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I mean, it kind of just clicked. I yeah. could be wrong, but that's, they do it. They <laughs> do. <laughs> Maybe it's just a coincidence. Yeah, <laughs> so anyway. the, I mean, the, it was the longest match of the night. They had like half hour, I think. Yeah. That wasn't that special. That I just didn't. No, I think it might be because we've already had the match. I don't. Know. I don't... Yeah. It was. It was. The, it was one of the least. Exciting. Yeah. Exciting. Like we, it, was, it wasn't a bad match. I mean, but it's also, you know, when you watch it over in England, if you are watching it live, it does finish about four o'clock in the morning. So by the time we were like, oh. So I was like... And we've knackered already. I know. It's only midnight. No, it's not midnight. midnight. 11. <laughs> Past my bedtime. Like, yeah. Um, but, um... we drive home now. Uh, we bet. So I said my mate's going to win this. Did I say Daniel Bryan? You did. Oh, shame on me. <laughs> so I won. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Again. <laughs> it, it's good that WWE have said, okay. This is so different. But there's also these rumours of Seamus coming back interrupting the match and we had nothing. And I really do worry the fact that Roman Reigns is meant to carry like a show, essentially. But I heard that Brock is not losing at WrestleMania. Yeah. That would be interesting. I heard that Roman Reigns doesn't win it, so who knows? Mm. But then, can we really? Can I really stand having a part-time champion for another like year? No, <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I can. If it comes back a bit more, I'm not having it. Yeah, but I think there'll be backlash about that anyway. Yeah, true. So, but um, especially because money in the bank's the pay-per-view after. Yeah, Seth Rollins needs to cash it in, man. Seth, you've got. Pay-per-view. You've got to say five days to cash in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 35 days. In, cash in at WrestleMania, please. And that's only if Brock Lesnar shows up. <laughs> yeah. Um. So, yeah, I won the, f- the prediction thing. A 6-1. Mm. So I'm very smart over here. There. Fiction. Yeah, so I, I shall recite on our next review. I can't wait to hear this. It's going to be hilarious. like, Bray. You come, Bray. You, you can do it about Pre branding. Yeah. Maybe with a bit of bad news in there. <laughs> oh god. It's yeah. not it's gonna be awful. I don't even think it's gonna make sense, but you know what? <laughs> do oh, no. Be positive, it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be amazing and I'm gonna become a a fan fiction. Yeah, fan fiction right now, right now, yeah. It's gonna be a movie about everything. I know. Um, so what should we rate the pay per view, Coral? I generally quite enjoyed it, but I think I'm rating it higher because of how much I enjoyed it last night. See, I'm thinking six. I don't think. I think but that's r- better than what we've had. I think Raw Rumble was the better one. You do? Yeah, I enjoy Raw Rumble a lot more. I really enjoy Fastlane. I was still a bit buzzy about it today, though. Like, 
No, I definitely don't think it's better than a seven. That was Royal Rumble. Hmm. I think a six. I mean, watching it again, I mean, a great pay per view would be watching it a second time. You still feel the same way. Yeah. And I'm not. But I did generally enjoy myself. So I think a six is pretty fair. Yeah. But it's definitely one of the better ones we've had. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. picked it up anyway. So yeah, that's good. New year, new feuds, etc. Yeah, they need a bit more progression, I think that's the problem. Yeah. They'll, they'll work eventually. But yeah, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Retweet, tweet us. Retweet us. Follow us on Facebook. And follow us on Instagram. Bed. And don't forget to tune in for Raw <laughs> to see Coral Fabric. Ah! <laughs> oh, God. Imagine if we get, like, most views on that one. Like, okay. <laughs> Yeah, it'll be like really good reviews. I'll be like, well, I've got to do the whole thing now. Haven't I? I can't wait for the comments. <laughs> I bet it ends up being quite long as well. Is there a character limit on Tumblr? Uh, no. <laughs> are you? How are you gonna do this? I'm gonna write out and then read the transcript. No. I'm just gonna read like a paragraph, but I'm gonna put the whole entire <laughs> thing on Tumblr for everyone to see. So get a load of Maybe we should do a Facebook exclusive. Of you doing the whole thing. Oh, God. I can't read things very well. <laughs> it's fine. Anyway, <laughs> bye. <laughs>